With concerts still not allowed due to the pandemic, some have switched to an online format. This season, the Miami-based mainly Mozart, Fe Mozart Festival has now posted its entire live season online. As CBS 4's Lisa Petrillo reports, it features seven concerts by award-winning classical musicians performing live from their living rooms around the world. For 28 years, the mainly Mozart Festival, presented by the Miami Chamber Music Society, has been bringing first-rate classical music performances to South Florida audiences in Coral Gables. The festival was scheduled to start up again for their season in May. Artistic director Marina Radushina told me by mid-March, due to COVID-19, they knew concerts weren't going to happen. We were very fortunate to have a really fantastic partner, the University of Miami Libraries, and together we came together and um, decided that basically we're going to create seven programs uh, that are going to go live uh, at the same time that the regular main the Mozart concerts would have. The concerts were live in May and June, curated broadcasts now available online. It features top-notch lineups of artists and performances and conversation, sharing behind-the-scenes insights, excerpts from past performances, and live musical moments. We contacted uh, musicians all around the world, uh, some of the you know, first, first rate, some of the best musicians out there. Um, and um, we're very fortunate to secure uh, our musicians for the seven programs. And this is how the whole thing started. Here is Zlatimir Fung, first prize winner of the International Tchaikovsky Competition, performing live from his living room in Massachusetts. This is one of the sort of upsides of the situation that uh, our audience has got a chance to go into the living rooms of these amazing artists of you know, Grammy Award winners, of winners of major international competitions. And uh, they you know, chatted with us and played for us from their living rooms. They answered questions live, from, all from their living rooms. Mainly Mozart now pivoted because of this new normal, but still providing a much welcome musical escape. We are about music and we are about community and about connecting people and about experiencing beautiful moments together. And this year, only different because it was all online, but nonetheless, we managed to connect some people and we managed to create those moments of beauty. You can find the seven performances on their Facebook at Miami Chamber Music Society and on their website later in the week. Fantastic stuff. For more information, log on to our website at cbsmiami.com. I'm Lisa Petrillo, CBS 4 News.